Hello girls and boys. Welcome to Storytime Fun. We hope you enjoy it. Today's book is called Seals, written by Ellen Catala. Seals, they live both in the sea and on the land. Some of them weigh as much as rhinoceroses. What are they? Hint, turn the page to find out. Seals, um, are seals fish? No, they're a kind of ocean mammal that scientists call a pinniped, which means fin foot. Like all mammals, including people, seal babies drink milk from their mothers. There are three main kinds of seal. One, fur seals and sea lions have ears you can see. They're called eared seals. California sea lion, stellar sea lion, northern fur seal, and New Zealand fur seal. Two, earless seals, such as harbor seals, bearded seals, ring seals, have ears that don't show on the outside. Harbor seal, bearded seal, and ring seal. Three, walruses have tusks. Seals range in size from the four ton, or 3,600 kilograms, southern elephant seal to a 150 pound, or 68 kilogram, bacal seal. Do seals walk? or swim? Both. They swim much more gracefully than they walk. Their soft, smooth bodies glide through the water. Eared seals swim by moving their powerful front flippers. Earless seals and walruses swim by flapping their wide back flippers. Water speeds. Slowest walruses travel up to six miles per hour or 10 kilometers per hour. Fastest fur seals and sea lions travel up to 34 miles per hour or 55 kilometers per hour. California sea lion and harbor seal. On land, they move much more slowly. Fur seals, sea lions, and walruses can pull their back flippers under their bodies to use as legs so they can walk. Earless seals, however, can't use their rear flippers for walking, so they use their front flippers to drag their bodies. How do seals stay warm? They have a thick layer of fat under their skin called blubber. The fat keeps their insides warm. They don't seem to mind cold on their thick skin. Many seals cover themselves with snow and sleep on ice. A walrus's skin is two inches or five centimeters thick. This is the hooded seal, the male. Fur seals have a layer of blubber and two fur coats to keep them warm. The bottom coat is soft and thick, so it traps body heat. Well, the top coat is coarse and oily, so it keeps out water. That's the bearded seal. All seals molt, which means they shed their old coats each year to reveal new ones underneath. Can seals see underwater? Yes! In fact, seals can see very well in the depths of the ocean where human eyes would see only blackness. Their tear glands put a film of fine, clear oil over their eyes. The oil protects against salt water and blowing snow. On land, everything they look at is a little blurry. They sometimes mistake a motionless polar bear for a mound of snow. Knowing this, 
Polar bears stand very still. If a seal they are stalking looks their way. What do seals eat? Hmm, most eat seafood. Fish, shellfish, and small ocean animals such as squid. Some seals eat other kinds of animals. The leopard seal eats penguins and seal pups as well as fish. Sea lions often swallow rocks. Over 100 were found in the stomach of one animal. Wow. Walruses eat huge amounts of food, about 100 pounds or 45 kilograms a day. They root in the mud at the bottom of the ocean for shellfish. But rogue walruses, which are very rare, eat meat, especially seals. When fishing is poor, seals can always live off their blubber for a while, but not forever. They need that blubber to stay warm. Mm. Where do seals live? All over the world. But they prefer places that are cold. Most seals live in the salt water. However, the Bakel seal lives in Lake Bakel in Russia. And a few other kinds of seals also live in freshwater lakes in very cold regions. In general, eared seals meet in big groups called rookeries. Earless seals are more likely to live alone or in small groups, but there are exceptions to this rule. All walruses, except for the rogue walruses, live in large groups. So the walrus and then the northern fur seal, and then the harbor seal, and the California sea lion, and the elephant seal, and uh, the ringed seal, the bearded seal, ooh, the harp seal, and the hooded seal, and the stellar sea lion, and the New Zealand fur seal and the New Zealand sea lion. What about babies? Mother seals give birth to one baby, called a pup, about once a year. The mother usually goes to the place where she was born to have her pup. All seal pups are born either on land or on ice. Harp seals, for example, will only bear their pups on ice. Great hooded seal pups drink up to 20 pounds or nine kilograms of milk every day for four days after they're born. <gasps> wow. Earless seals that have babies on the ice floes do not hunt for food while they're nursing their young. They just live off their fat. These seals do not let their pups out of sight until they are weaned, which is usually four days to eight weeks after birth. Mother seals recognize their babies by their cry and their smell. The stellar sea lion drops their newborn pup over and over on rocks until it cries so she can learn to recognize its voice. Eared seals may nurse their pups from a few months to a year. The mother often leaves her pups from time to time to feed at sea. Eared seal pups are often in danger of being trampled by adult males called bulls. Some bulls, which may be five times as large as the females, will actually attack and kill pups that get in their way. Walruses are very good mothers. They keep a close eye on their babies, called calves, for two years. Do seals have any enemies? Oh yes, polar bears, sharks, killer whales, and people. 
That is why some seals have pups on ice floes, which are hard for their enemies to reach. Walruses are so huge that they have no enemies except for people. Human hunters in the 18th and 19th centuries killed so many seals that many species almost became extinct. If only those hunters had followed the wisdom of the Inuit, the native people of the Arctic, the Inuit valued seals because they depended upon them for food, clothes, and some housing materials. They never killed more animals than they needed to survive. Today, many countries have laws that protect seals. Bet you didn't know. <laughs> A walrus's body turns from white to red when it gets out of the water and lies in the sun. Male elephant seals may go without food for 100 days during breeding season. The greatest danger to seals now is caused by people taking too many fish from the ocean, which doesn't leave enough food for the seals. A harbor seal at the New England Aquarium learned to say his name, Hoover, and phrases such as, come over here and get out of here. <laughs> seals in danger of being eaten by polar bears don't sleep soundly. They wake up every few minutes to look around. Seals have the same bones in their flippers that humans have in their hands. When a mother seal has been away, she greets her pup by brushing noses. You might say their love is... Sealed with a kiss. Aww. Baby harp seal. Well, that's it for today. We'll see you next time.